Hey guys, John Laska, Laska's Decoys here. I uh, got a grayling. Uh, I decided to make another one just because of the colors and how vibrant they are. Um, and it's a fish that I really like to try to catch fly fishing sometime. Uh, but uh, pretty much all the details that are on a grayling are really on this fish. Uh, always signed and dated. Uh, went the extra step and even colored the bottom of the fins. Uh, the back fins on a grayling are actually different colors than the front fins. Uh, so I want to make sure that that was on there. Um, and the spots and the turquoise and the blues and the purple iridescence that I got on this guy uh, with the top fin and even those back fins re really will make this a centerpiece in any collection. It'll really stand out. Uh, and uh, yeah, I even tipped the scales with light blue. You can kind of see that. But they are there. Uh, nice ripple tail. Nice glass eyes blended in. It's an overall really nice decoy. So we're going to go ahead and get this guy to swim. Make sure he sits level, swims right. I haven't tested him, I just got him big so you can see it. Yeah, that's just completely level. So bring him up here and just kind of let him go. Let him do his own thing. Yep, very nice swimming decoy. Just a nice gliding decoy. You can kind of see him pop up there a little bit, uh, string catching a little bit, but overall, very, very nice decoy. Give him a good couple jigs here, and you can really see that he 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 keeps his levelness to the bottom of the tank as well. There's no flaring or anything. It's a very, very nice decoy. And that is the grayling. Hope you guys enjoy this one. Really colorful. Uh, just a really pretty decoy. Um, that tail is, the ripples and that I can get on the tail is just awesome. So, well, that is the grayling. Thank you guys for watching.